Hey everybody, what's going on? Dylan here. Welcome to my channel. You're, this is your place for life, business, and success. Today, I wanted to give you guys five awesome reading techniques that you can use immediately to improve your reading game and become that person who everybody goes to for advice. Stay tuned. Okay, your first tip is don't be afraid to read a book more than once. Okay, I know so many people out there Pretty sure they're called like self-development junkies or something like that where they read a book, right? They read the book for the first time and then they never look at it again, all right? And they don't even use the stuff in the book. They just read the book and then it's just completely done for. Don't be afraid to read a book more than once because every time you read that book, I guarantee you're going to get something new, something that you missed from the first time or the second time or the third time and you guys will continue to learn from that book. Don't read a book just once, throw it out and then never use it again. Read it consistently, constantly. Read it back to back to back if you want to. And I promise you guys will be picking up more info from that book each time. All right, next one is make sure you guys are reading consistently, okay? Set a schedule or set a time every day where you guys can sit down and read a book for five minutes, 10 minutes, 15 minutes, one hour, whatever. Just as long as you guys have a consistent time for you guys to read every single day, that way you guys can read you know, a certain amount of pages every day and you guys will continue to learn and you guys will continue to harness the information from the book. And I don't know about you guys, but if I go a while without reading a book, I completely forget what the book was talking about and then I get off track and I don't remember where I was and it, it just becomes a, a mess and I have to go back and reread things over and over again. Uh, I don't like it. So with me personally, I like to read consistently. That's why I'm telling you guys, make sure you guys are reading consistently because it works and it helps you guys retain the information so that you guys are in the book and you guys know what the book is talking about. Okay, next one, and this is super important. Make sure you guys are using the tips. Make sure you guys are doing the uh, strategies, make sure you guys are doing the action items that the book tells you to do immediately, right away. Do not wait. If the book tells you right now, sit down and do this, you better put the book down, do the strategy or do the technique or whatever it is and do it right then and there. Don't be like, oh, you know what, I'm done reading this chapter, I'll do it. Because most likely, I mean, you're not. I mean, some people, I'm sure you will, but the majority of people will just keep reading through and then they're like, well, this book didn't give me anything. It's because you didn't use the strategies. You guys didn't do the techniques that the book told you to do. Use the action items that the book tells you to do immediately. Do it right then and there, and I promise you guys will remember hell of a lot more from the book. Okay, next one. Make sure you guys are highlighting, making notes, marking that book up, bookmarking pages, bending pages. Don't be afraid to mark the book up. Use it. I mean, make it look like a raggedy ass book. Do not be afraid to use the book uh, and highlight and making notes in it because I know so many people who are like, I just want to keep the book perfect. That's not what the book's for. The book is for you to learn, for you to study it, and for you to get information by it. Mark it up. Use a different, you know, whatever works for you guys, whatever kind of notes or note make note taking that you guys like. Don't be afraid to mark it up and make it look old, okay? Don't be the person who just wants the book to look pretty. Use it. Okay, now my last tip, and it's actually a tip that I'm doing right now, is make sure you guys are sharing the information that you guys learn from books with others. Talk about it, you know, in uh, uh, teach people about what you guys are learning. Explain the things that the book is talking about with other people. Hey, you know, whoever, you know, I just learned this in the book. You know, check it out. Or what do you guys think about this topic? The more you guys talk about it and the more you guys teach it, like what I'm doing right now, the more it becomes ingrained, you know, into you. The more you remember it and the more you're able to recall that information because you're talking about it. And what, like one thing is learning about it. Another thing is being able to teach and to show others and to talk about it with others. That way you really, really ingrain this information into your guys' brain. So there you guys have it. Five tips that you can use right now when you guys are reading your books that you can use to uh, remember a hell of a lot more from the books you're reading because don't be the person that's just reading the book and then doesn't remember anything by it or doesn't get anything from the book. Aim to get at least one thing, but make sure you guys are actually getting information from the book and remembering it because there's no point in reading a book if you guys don't remember or don't use the information from it. That, at that point, it's just a waste of money, all right? Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you guys subscribe to my channel, wherever the button's at. Subscribe to it or subscribe to my channel, <laughs> and I promise you I will be delivering content to you guys that is extremely vital and extremely important for you guys to be using in your everyday life. 
I'm uploading three days a week, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, so you guys can count on me to be getting that information to you guys. Make sure you guys are giving me a thumbs up. I really appreciate it. And share this video with someone who can really use this stuff. Share this video with the guy who's always reading books but then doesn't remember anything by it. All right? And last part, I want to give a shout out to my website, dylantedimer.com. Uh, on that website, I am, I'm always trying to upload um, blog posts from the videos that I make and I put it on there. Uh, and through there, you know, you guys can talk to me if you guys want. Make sure you guys are following me on social media. Links are down below. So again, I really appreciate you guys watching this video. Talk to you guys soon.